to the gantry today no rain in sight i'm derek ray in the commentary position and i'm joined for expert analysis by my partner stuart robson and with the atmosphere really building up nicely we should be in for a terrific contest it is manchester city against paris saint germain well derek when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game Roberto Baggio I'm mopping up defensively and he did what he had to do defensively promising pass it is advantage Manchester City here Claude Makalele Well, here it is again, and you have to say, this is a very good volley. His technique is absolutely perfect. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Messi. Chance to do damage, but they dealt with the threat posed. Save, but still a chance. Well, nothing comes of it. And clears the danger. Ibrahimovic! He just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Take it away. Missing. Now options are plenty but really sticking to their task defensively. Claude Bacalele. That's a well-struck pass. Rashford! And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here we can see just how good the cross from Rashford was. And then Haaland demonstrates his ability in the air. He judges the flight, meets it solidly and beats the keeper. That's how to head a ball. That is that for the first half here. So back in business here and PSG dominating the proceedings in the first half. Will we see a similar pattern in the second 45? Well, the attack will peter out. Keeper's ball. And he clears the danger. And across the byline, a goal kick as a result. It's to be two substitutes in one go for City. De Bruyne. Claude Makalele. De Bruyne. Well, we're into the final half hour. Keeping the ball moving. De Bruyne. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, as you can see, it was a fairly simple finish in the end but you still have to be in the right place. Keep your composure and finish it off. And that's exactly what he did. And Manchester City going to the bench. A double substitution here. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. And the pass by Dybala gobbled up. Very quick thinking there. Chukwese. Andres Silva. Here's Mbappe. Well, we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Ibrahimovic. On to Makalele. Ibrahimovic. Well, not far away from the final whistle, and PSG very much in control. 
Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many... And that will do it for this game anyway. And it goes into the history books as a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their performance? Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. this evening it's absolutely ideal i'm derek ray and i'm joined for expert analysis by stuart robson and with the atmosphere really building up nicely we should be in for a terrific contest it's paris saint germain facing borussia dortmund well derek we can talk about coaches and their methods but it's now down to the players which ones are going to stand out who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire it should be a cracking game though Holland. Well, it was straight up the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. And here's the pass over the top to Lionel Messi. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw in. De Bruyne. Radio. Messi. Jack Grealish, just the challenge that was required, and that'll be a Dortmund ball. Still alive, and it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Makalele, and the pass was just that little bit off, nearly found its target. Holland and taking it away. He continues his run. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Oh, what an opportunity. Will he? And Lionel Messi has scored the opening goal of the contest. Such a boost. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. And the ball is moving again, and the question is, how will PSG reply to that setback? Well, he's certainly not alone. Just the clearance that was called for. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. So into the second half, Borussia Dortmund hold the advantage, but it's a long way from being done and dusted here. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Holland. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And he's through here. And with that, they thwarted the opportunity. 30 minutes left for play. Oh, oh surely. Oh! Two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Three changes in one go here for PSG. Goal. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. What can they do to stop him running at them? Messi. 
Now Neymar. And Neymar has done it! Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Substitution it is for Dortmund. Now the ball is moving again. The push is on from Paris Saint-Germain. Can they come up with an equaliser? Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Can he put it away? And the keeper in position to grab hold of it. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Alexander Zinchenko. Grealish. Zinchenko. Return to Zinchenko. Just wanted to get it out of there. And that is that, the final whistle, the big headline here, PSG lose. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And without doubt, a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Paris Saint-Germain facing Real Madrid. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Vinicius Junior. Martinez! And a goal! A significant deflection! And no wonder the goalkeeper is looking up at the sky in disbelief! Well, as you can see, he gets a bit lucky here. The deflection just had the keeper wrong-footed, but he won't worry about that. Goal. Underway once more, and it's going to be interesting to see whether or not PSG can articulate an appropriate reply. Makelele. And a timely intervention. Alert defending. Well, time just challenged magnificently. And it's been knocked forward to Zlatan Ibrahimovic. And the referee has decided to award the free kick to PSG. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. It's gone in. A goal for PSG beyond the goalkeeper to square things up. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Well, good use of the ball. Must take the lead here. And a goal! Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. PSG chasing this game. Let's see if they can succeed on that front. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Pressing high, and they have the ball again. De Bruyne... Here's Ibrahimovic. Just the clearance that was called for. This corner kick might help them. Well, still an issue here. And he takes it on. And the last touch off the defender. So a corner coming up. Well, you have to categorise that as a missed opportunity. Vinicius Junior. Given away by Real Madrid. Real. 
Rashford. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. With the club secretary, please note that Mr. Moon has left the building. Well, it is advantage Real after the first 45 minutes, but there's a long way from being settled. Balak. Erling Haaland. Long distance effort. Keeper did his job. Kevin De Bruyne. Makalele. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. And it's a goal for Paris Saint-Germain to square this game. Well, here it is again. He's alive to the situation. He makes good contact with the ball and he keeps it down. That's a nice headed goal. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Now options are plenty. Gerard! Oh, a moment of pure class! Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, let's look at this again. He judges the flight of the ball, he sets himself ready to strike it, and then he just hits it so sweetly. That's the perfect volley. 3-2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. A potential danger. Still not clear. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Lewandowski. Well, the danger is still there. Well, he almost nodded that one in. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Neymar. Messi. Cristiano Ronaldo. Good tackle. Well, this game is ebbing away, and the situation currently not favourable for PSG, Stuart. Well, what a finale this will be. They've had so many chances throughout the game, but they just need to find it. And that will be all for this game. The final whistle is sounded, and it's a defeat for PSG. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance.